Hello and thanks for watching. I'm the Old Ape and this is Vintage Story. I'm creating a new single player world and I'm going through some customization. The world seed is going to be random. I'm just trying to change some things like uh, uh, the days per month I want to reduce a little bit and go on um, six days so it's going to be somehow shorter we could do also three days but I let it like that because probably I'm gonna work a little bit also off camera through winters block gravity I let it like sand and gravel then let me check again walk speed the food spoilage rate I want to increase it and uh, make it uh, 200% so it makes a little bit more sense than to have some uh, food uh, preservation and in the same way I want to increase the growing time of the saplings uh, slightly faster is uh, 0.75 percent to durability and whatever i let it like it is i need to enable the propic node search radius and i'm gonna set it up to six blocks the global deposit spawn rate is okay the micro block chiseling most cubic blocks Temporal storms, temporal storm late, uh, length uh, is going to stay like that. Temporal stability is okay, but I want to set the temporal rifts off. And there's a reason for that, because uh, I don't really like uh, right now to have uh, uh, surface uh, drifters all over the place all the time. Sleeping during the temporal storms, I'm gonna allow it because then I can decide uh, every time what I want to do. The rest of the settings can stay like that because I don't want to change the, uh, the spawn uh, ratios and uh, all that stuff. Okay, apply and let's create the world. And here we go. This is the customization of the skin and the class I want to change and use my default things like to have the breeches uh, Cuba and uh, spiky known uh, upset not angry known and my side whiskers and this is the color I want to have confirm the skin now I am using uh, collaborative classes is a mode that is changing the, um, the, the uh, vanilla classes we can go through these uh, uh, later on but uh, you have some perks and so some uh, disadvantages for each class of course and um, I didn't touch it is exactly like the mod developer um, made it I'm going to choose the forester because I like uh, the perks so confirm the class let me check why my sound is not working and here we go I had some uh, problems with my headphones but now uh, everything sounds great here we go I pick up already these uh, things the seeds and some food even it's if it's a little bit earlier now so first things first I need to collect uh, sticks and uh, stone or um, obsidian or flint in order to produce my first uh, tools and uh, improve my uh, 
gameplay. So the point is this, I don't need that. I don't need any uh, of this, of those seeds. Oh, this is cool. This is uh, walnut. Really good, really good. I like it. Now, I see already a um, trader and that's interesting. So, first of all, I need to expand my inventory. In order to do that, I need to collect cattails and craft some hand basket. I need to collect food as soon as I can because uh, the um, because the player will become um, oh look at that so I found some tools uh, yeah okay I have already the uh, the knife and some gears three gears okay that's okay i don't need them right now but i could uh, need them later this is claystone i love claystone in the um, building um, i like how it looks in the building So let's see, we have a treasure hunter, very good, very good, it's not bad, five gears, two gears, okay, okay, 29 gears, we can sell also this, okay, perfect, perfect, so I mark it, because I don't know if uh, I'm going to... Um, to, s to settle down here and save it I need to here we go okay so this area looks interesting because I have the trader uh, we have also some um, some uh, water a lake over there I can see this looks like peat and probably there is some clay here around if I can find some clay that would be great some clay would be great and we have already cattails so let me collect the cattails first so I can expand a bit my inventory and uh, after that I want to to get my um, I need also some other tools. Ten. I can make one immediately. Okay. Yeah, let's move over. I need another two of these uh, knives then I want to make myself a spear an axe and a shovel so with that I should have uh, uh, my um, my set my initial set of uh, tools and weapons and uh, that allows me to go uh, on with my projects I need uh, the shovel I need the shovel and the axe very good In that Perfect. A little bit more organized. Uh, let's collect uh, another bit of cattails so we can make ourselves a basket too.
this could be we need also grass so let me clean up this and this looks like um, some meteoric iron it could be uh, probably it isn't no it's not okay never mind upon collecting all the flint we can very good um, I want to collect this because uh, mm, this is also um, introduced by a mod um, and um, you will see now I'm gonna explain to you how it works so I'm going to invest um, some uh, some sticks in a ladder so I can collect more sticks and I'm gonna chop down this tree Oh, I just noticed there are some some peat yeah, that I can uh, collect and use for different uh, as a different source of fuel. Okay, here we go. So let me do one thing. I can do it. Okay, perfect. Don't need that. I don't need that. Not. Okay, I can do like that. Okay. Here we go. This is a uh, uh, carry capacity, another mod that allows to um, put and move around uh, basket and containers uh, even when they are full and this is saving a lot of uh, time and helping with uh, the inventory I'm still collecting things and it's fine so we found here Ah, that's also good. Uh, we found some peat. The um, lo location is stable. But I hear uh, plenty of... Uh, or, be or better, I'm hearing some, uh, some uh, drifters moaning. So I want to move away from here. I want to go a little bit away. Let me check this this side of the of the lake. Well, well, this could also be a nice place. This could be a nice place. I think I'm gonna settle down here. Yeah, I'm close to the to the large lake that can be helpful. Let me check. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. This area or probably over there also because it's a little bit open, but um here I'm closer to to some um some trees and I need wood. So, let's start collecting some uh, building materials. I need grass for uh, different things, set up a fire and also to craft a bed so I can uh, get through the night without uh, really uh, 
spend the whole night if I don't need it. I need also to craft some torches. I said that I'm going to settle down here near the lake. Yeah, why not? I like it. Here could be a good uh, location. It's fine. It's fine. So, yeah, exactly here. Exactly here. Perfect. Here we go. Some. Uh, I'm gonna use uh, some packed dirt because it. Um, it's good. It's cheap. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. And then we have the six here. It's not going to to look beautiful, of course. And I'm building here because uh, the idea is to uh, finish to collect the, the soil that I have under my feet and use that one to make some more uh, packet soil or compact. How oh, is it called? Packet dirt. Okay. It doesn't sound really uh, nice, packet dirt. But it's something. We need to start somewhere. And this is uh, very cheap. Uh, I could also make some, uh, some mud bricks, but uh, in order to do that I will need some uh, clay too. Here we go, I did that too. Another good uh, thing of the packed dirt is that it's not uh, going to uh, allow grass to grow on top of it. So it's gonna uh, keep the, uh, the floor of this uh, hut or shelter uh, a little bit uh, more clean than normal dirt. So for the beginning I think it's uh, good enough to have something like that. Where is here? Yeah. yeah. Hungry, probably. Here we go. Let's eat. Perfect. Now. I'm gonna drop that there. And these... Uh, here. I have some room there too, and um, I don't have really a lot of uh, wood, unfortunately, so I need to wait a bit. a roof on top of my head I'm placing uh, the, the floor here so it's a little bit cleaner I'll just a little bit and now I can set up a fire yeah here we go I need this to 
so I can start the fire. Drop that. For now, I'm going to use two of these as firewood. Start that. It can take some time. Here we go. Well, I should have some... I have some food. It's not that bad. That I don't need that. Okay. Uh, what I need is instead one, two, three. Give me three for now. Then I need one, two, three. So I can put down a, a bed somewhere. Like that. And... Finish the clothes here. Hmm. Or now I do like that. So I can uh, see outside if it's uh, <laughs> the the sun is uh, uh, getting up. Now I have my torches. I want one uh, here. One comes with me, and the other one can uh, stay somewhere here. Okay. And also this. Then. This one comfort. Perfect. So this is the the first uh, day, and um, okay, it's not really uh, that much, but uh, at least I managed to to build a shelter have um, some food. I've been lucky because I found this uh, uh, pine tree uh, hollow. Well, it's 10 slots. Unfortunately, this uh, is not uh, affected by the carry capacity mod, so we cannot use it as uh, a movable um, uh, container, but it doesn't matter. I like it. Uh, it's part of uh, the, um, I think it's a wild farm. I, I will let a list in the um, description of the video uh, where you can find uh, all the, um, the mods that I'm using right now. Probably I'm gonna add some in the future or remove some. Um, right now I'm playing with the uh, 1.16.3 I think is the version, the last uh, uh, stable version version of uh, Vintage Story. So um, if I'm upgrading or whatever, probably I need to um, change uh, some mods. Probably something is not going to be compatible. We will think about that later. Anyways, I need to eat something. And in the next episode, I'm going to uh, check a little bit uh, around the uh, surrounding, the neighborhood, and uh, try to understand if I can settle here, or um, if I need to move uh, somewhere else, if I f mm, find a better place. I don't know 
this could also look like some clay but I'm not really sure anyways thanks a lot for watching for stopping by if you want to leave a comment if you have questions if you, if you have suggestion please feel free to uh, comment below and we will see the next time since then have a nice one bye bye